Nolan Raposa, the local boy, he has a lot of experience out here on the amateur side. Been a semifinalist before, but Crosby Cole Pinto, former champion at this venue. He's won the Jack Surf Boards Pro in 2019 and getting another great result this year so far, Pete. I uh, did have a little check-in with uh, Troy Eckert. We'll get back to that. Raposa is going to get the first wave. The goofy foot out of Long Beach, California, goes to the air, throws that one away. And signs of what's coming up in this matchup priority now switches to Crosby Colapinto. Ford open things up. Raposa looking to take to the air, finds the ramp, but just can't stay connected. Yeah, and unfortunately right there, just a missed opportunity. Crosby eyeing up a right. Here he goes. Smooth rail carve, pops the finish and a little layback. So nice start for the 22-year-old out of San Clemente, California. Big moment for him. Big moment right here. Talk us through the replay, Mitch. Yeah, great carve to open things up and a lot of extra body English right there with the finish for Crosby. I feel like Nolan has something to say about it here with priority on the inside. Looking like it's going to be a right for him, Kipes. Nolan looking right. A little lip glide to get through. Lost of traction there. That bobble's going to cost him. Tries to make up for it with a little disco spin. Gets the, the fins loose. I like the attention, but Mitchell, could he? Could Nolan Raposa be a little too pumped up? Yeah, you could be a little overamped. I could see that, but I also feel like knowing the significance of this seat as, I mean, he goes down to a knee basically, recovers well. And, dude, that recovery going straight into reverse afterwards, that is extremely difficult. So, yeah. 21 minutes, 35 seconds. Priority to Crosby. Crosby's going to let Nolan Raposa take this one. Let's see what Noel Rap has for us. Into the air. Backside. Yanks on the rail, but can't get in front. Peter, about redlining. Yeah. He pulls one of those. All of a sudden, it's a whole different story. Crosby going left into the pier. Sticking to the face, keeping the rails clean on that mayhem driver that he's on. And just taking a real traditional approach here, but smart heat surfing. He's going to complete another wave and get another meaningful score. Yeah, and the driver, you're normally seeing that model being ridden at much more high performance waves, waves with a lot more power. Which was a lot of rounded pins, mm -hmm. but he's on this squash tail right here. This is his last summer's groveler board. Oh. Well, it seems like the thing's still in great shape as we look at that turn right there. A lot of commitment down the line, Peter. Unfortunately for him, at the end of this wave, faded out a bit too much. Wasn't able to get one more good section. Glassy conditions. Eyeing up this one. Decides not Ooh. to go. Handing it over to Crosby a little deeper on this left. Colapinto is going to say yes, thank you. And a trip to the lip a couple times. A little sticky there. And maybe that's exactly Agreed. why Nolan said, hey. Go ahead. I really like to see him using those opportunities when they come as well, and it seems like he might have a chance here to go right. One more time. Ooh. Looks right, goes left. Just a lip glide there, floater maneuver, and that thing just mushed out. So he handed over priority to Crosby Colapinto, who has a commanding lead over him. Nolan's paddling. Nolan Raposa looks for an air, looks for a ramp, and you see now frustration. I feel I feel the frustrations happening, and Nolan again needs to calm down. Here we go with uh, Nolan Raposa under priority. Here we go. Now he's putting it together. But go. Yes. <laughs> I know. I feel you on that one. He's adapting to what Nolan's doing. Knowing the necessity of Nolan right now needing the 8.67, you're just going to take away the best waves that you can in the remaining minutes. Glides through there. Raposa off the bottom. Snaps. Throwing some spray. Meets that oncoming section. And now we're back in the game for Nolan Raposa. Wait for that score. It's going to be his best score so far in this matchup. The 7-3-3. We'll take a look at the replay here. Carries great speed through this floater. He's been having such great projection with that board. Great whip and a finish right there, getting early to the section. The little tail whip, three nice turns. Nolan finds the left, throws it in the air, puts it down, engages a fin for that reverse. Nice air reverse, needs a little bit more on the inside here. Layback hack, <laughs> points it. <laughs> and 
He's pumped up. Well, he's trying to get the crowd involved, too. Get some more energy going. Four minutes to go. He's going to do that. Replay, Pete. Well, and again, this is one of the go-to moves that he has. The section a little bit flat, let's say. I mean, he did get the, the lip there, but it didn't steep and not break there. And the judges will take note of that in regards to how they're going to score that air. It is pretty darn dynamic. This is a good angle of this one. So the section's there, but the landing's out kind of more in the flats and rotates around it. No full rotation there. So take all that into consideration. But uh, it feels like, you know, probably very similar to where he's at with the 5.6. It's good that he actually got that last maneuver there. Probably added a good quarter to half point. Under priority, Carlson is going to let Nolan go. Here we go. We repose again. Slash to begin. Tapered wave. No more opportunity. And Crosby's got some nerves of steel out it there does. right now. I mean, to let that wave go. He looked he down the line, you see. He looked down the line and decided, no. And props to Nolan. He's trying. Every wave that comes through. You mentioned only a second event out of the first four. Kaipo has two more after this. And he's been so close to qualifying a few years now. But Crosby's got something else on his mind. Crosby takes off on this one. Utilizes priority. Sharp surfing for Cola Pinto. And making his way to the beach a little bit early. San Clemente. They're all about it. Meanwhile, Crosby Cola Pinto doing it for San Clemente. All of his friends, Cole Hauschman down there, who's already qualified, wants his buddy to qualify with him for the 2024 tour, and he's on his way.